how you can upload a PDF inside of your Klaviyo emails for your customers to use, to download a freebie, a guide, anything like that. I'm gonna be showing you exactly how to do that inside this video. So, of course, you wanna go ahead, log into your Klaviyo account, create your campaign, put in your segments, all of that good stuff. And we're going, I'm going to show you how to do this in a very basic, simple way. So the template that we will be using is a basic one column template. All right. Now there is, there are several different ways you can actually add a PDF to your Klaviyo email. All right. So the first thing I want to talk about is where you have your PDF saved. So let's say for example, you have created a PDF inside of Canva. Now, what you want to do is you can do a view only link, right? And you can copy that link. Or what I like to do with Canva documents, I like to download them into my Google Drive. So you can upload that file inside your Google Drive. And then you would just go to that file. You will go to share and then you want to do it with anyone who has that link. So you can copy that link. All right. You will go back inside of your Klaviyo email. And let's say you want to attach it to a banner. So I'm just going to pick any banner here to use for demonstration purposes. And all you will have to do is take the exact link and you will copy and paste it where it says link address. All right, now you can also attach this link to a button. So wherever you wanna drag and drop your button, where you have the URL permissions, you will copy and paste it there as well. Now, let's say you want to go a step further and you want to add the link inside of your actual text on the email. So all you will have to do is highlight whatever part you want the customer to uh, click on inside the email to uh, go ahead and download that PDF. And you want to click this link button right here and where the URL is, you want to copy and paste and there you have it, simple, easy. Um, you can put this link on your images, you can put it in a button, and you can also put it inside of the text, all right? So now your customers have three different options as to how they can access your PDF.